hi, this is Tudorik P, and this is Idioms 570. The idiom today is to get on a soapbox or be on a soapbox. Okay, somebody wants a screenshot, do it right now. Let's get right to it. If someone is on or gets on one soapbox, he or she is sharing his or her opinion with a lot of passion, often in an unplanned way, usually to the annoyance of other people. All right, let's continue. You may also hear someone say to get off one soapbox in order to tell the person who is talking in an unpleasant or annoying way to stop talking. All right. Uh, the origin of this phrase dates back to at least the 1800s when people would literally go to a busy public place like a park or other area and stand on a sturdy soapbox as a makeshift platform to give strong emotional speeches especially about politics or other things in society. So they probably made those soapboxes really pretty strong, so they, they felt safer standing on them. So this is where we get the soapbox idea from. They would stand on them like a platform and then give their speeches. All right, let's go on. Uh, okay, good. So much to about part of this some people may be interested and would listen or might be annoyed or some others might be annoyed some other people so some people might be very interested you know stand there and listen to their speech and other people might like get annoyed like why are you making the noise you're disturbing the whole park or someplace something like that all right let's continue uh it is very famous for taking place in hyde park in london in the 1870s but really it was in a lot of places and it spread to the u.s and and everywhere where people would just do this of course today we have the internet so you don't really need to do this but back then that's what people would do they just go to a public place and just start talking like they were giving a speech and you know some people might gather around and listen some may not let's continue all right but the point is we still use the phrase to get on somebody's soapbox if they're very strongly or emotionally giving their opinion about something. All right, so we have four examples. Here's the first one. He is getting on his soapbox again about how much he hates that political party. Yeah, about politics would be a common one. Uh, number two, uh, anytime he gets on his soapbox, I make an excuse to leave. Well, like I say, a lot of times people are annoyed by it. Uh, number three, she is getting on her soapbox again about how not enough people care about the environment and how the world is going to end if you don't conserve energy. Yeah, well, some people get to be very strong into, you know, conservation and things like that and, you know, environment and, and so on. Number four, can you just get off your soapbox and talk about something less serious so we can have a relaxing day? <laughs> That's just the way you may hear it used. Anyway, I hope you got it. I hope it was clear. I hope it was very informative. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.